Hello everyone! Today we're doing the Where's Balthasar story instance within One Path Ends in Living World Season 3. There are eight achievements in this story instance alone, so there will be timestamps just in case you want to skip some things. There will be one achievement that I'm just going to put an image up because it will be fairly easy, I don't need to go through it. And another one that I will have both an image and a separate guide for just because it's a little hard just with the image alone and it would take a lot of time to put it in this video. So first up is King Crab Achievement. The first location is here in this cavern. If you don't find the crab here, I'll show you the second location on our way up to the top. I'm also going to show how to get up to the top first with bouncing mushroom and then again with the jumping puzzle. Again, those timestamps if you want to miss stuff like that. So this is the method I, for whatever reason, enjoyed. And then before landing, heading right across to the waterfall. And I'm just going to quickly show you the second location for our king crab. Then it's probably here and you just need to kill it. All right, and we're going to take this bouncing mushroom right here. And this will take us to the top. We just have to take those wooden ladders and we're at the end. So, the jumping puzzle. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go right from the beginning, just in case. This jump, you just you just do it, and you're gonna think you're not gonna make it, but it's okay. So I take it slow up here. There's our waterfall if you're going for your king crab. And apologies for the camera angle. And now we're back to where the bouncing mushroom took us, so all together going to go up the last few three there's three boards oh jumping helps too all right so there is another achievement found in here called into the madness where you have to collect these books we already passed one book actually, it's uh, deep within the underwater. I'm going to link an image in case you would like to try and get them yourselves, but they're actually really tricky to see, so I have made an entirely separate guide for them. But I just wanted to note them because they are in this story instance. Uh, We're gonna wait for our friend to blow up. We're gonna pick up a fragment and we're gonna target our one right on the aspect on the door. All right, so our first statue. Take down one statue and you'll get the graffiti artist achievement. Take down all 17 statues and you'll get the art critic achievement. So this one is really easy, but instead of taking the time to point out every single one, I just mapped them out for you. 
just knowing what room they're in and how many would be enough for anyone to get it on their own. The blade sent reinforcements. Kill them! Nothing like a trail of bodies to lead you to your quarry. Our next achievement well, then, we're going to go for is with here? friends like Need these. It's a hidden as achievement. So instead of doing this you puzzle the am. original Everyone way, we're going to overload it. You notice those glyphs? They seem to react to bloodstone. Conveniently, they have stockpiles of it here. Are you going to get me out or must I do everything myself? So we're going to grab from a barrel. Like so we have two at the bottom to and two at the, the top. Glyphs, we're going to go for the top stone. right corner. Anise sent you, did she? The so top she left corner this time. Lord. I need to find the eye. She said you were tracking it. Oh, she did. She's crafty, that one. Going center on the left. Like two poppers in a coffin. So we're going bottom left. For Krita. That's one way to get it open. Ugh, definitely not the best way. Okay, it's been fun. I can brag that I fought beside the world famous Dragon Slayer, but now it's over. Off you go. You can't get rid of me that easy. Oh, all right. If you insist, we should split up. You can have the big burly door. I'll take the small one. No, we should stick together for safety. Yours or mine? <laughs> Fine. Small door first, then. But I'm in charge. You take point. This door's warded. Stand back. I'll get it. So why are you following the eye? It's a hobby. I'm a collector of... Mersat memorabilia. Aspects of Lazarus, to be specific. <sighs> Hang me. That sound never bodes well. They do not belong here. Stop them! That's how I do it. Accidentally taken down a statue before they get through the door. Enjoying your break? Okay, so there's a barrel to our left. So we have a break bar, and if we throw the bloodstone shard, it completely breaks chance. the bar for us, making this a lot easier. So highly recommend using the bloodstone shard. Time to die! 
once we take out our bloodstone protector, the shield will go away from this shard. Onward, my dear. The fate of Krita is in our hands. Hold on. So you're collecting aspects of Lazarus? What do you plan to do with them? That's classified. Civilian. You could have just said you were locking them up somewhere safe. Now I'm even more curious. Curiosity killed the commander. There's one shard left. Let's keep moving. Hmm. This one looks a little more complex than the last. Hope you brought a book. So in here, there is one person we want to target immediately. This, this person Let's right go. here. So this white mantle is going to try and run to the room next to us and inform the white mantle there. Basically, they're calling for reinforcements. And I'm going to let them run here in a second. See, you can even hear the call out. Stop him before he calls for reinforcements. By stopping them, you'll get the not on my watch achievement. Now there is a second part to this achievement. So we're going to finish what we're doing here, our barrels over here. So exact same thing as before. Use the shard on the protector, breaks the bar. So we're actually going to run over here to get the cleaning up the mess achievement. So basically the reinforcements that were never informed, we're just going to, you know, take them out. So we're now going to head to our final boss. So the one achievement I'm not covering is this one into the madness. So I'm gonna link that entirely below. You will not pass. This is the legacy of the white mantle. Don't be silly. Your only legacy is So I'm just waiting for one of those little mini dudes come over so I can there take your soul pleasure. so same thing as before I like to pull over the other dude as well and so you kind of get damage on both of them 
But that's just me. One at a time is perfectly acceptable. So, no barrel this time, but we do have our little friends here who like to explode. Your false gods are destined to die. All right, so we're going to go front center. Wow, I'm just getting thrown everywhere. We're going to go left center. Left top. Final one, right in the middle, in the back here. And now we can do our boss event. So we're gonna keep an eye on this defiance bar or when it turns blue. So at 75%, 50%, and 25%, you're going to wanna break the bar. And again, you're gonna use the bloodstone fragments to do that. Successfully doing that at all three points is going to get you the block the shock achievement. Also, if you have the counter mastery unlocked, you'll see that special action pop up and you'll be able to return to sender that attack. So we're at 75%, we're gonna pick up a shard I actually last minute targeted one of the bloodstone dudes there, but the AOE was close enough to actually hit our boss. So I'm gonna do better at showing you that, but the sound was making me panic. Felt like I had to rush there. Getting healthy. So we're at 50%, let me clearly show you this time. Pick up your fragment, target, and toss. You see that blue bar immediately breaks and it's a good time to go in. Just trying to clear out a few of these dudes. They are everywhere. Fine, you get like caught in this loop if you have too many of them hanging around. Yeah, yeah, look, yeah, I'm in the loop. Because <laughs> they can take you out. You'll see like a tiny red AoE when they're dropping down, and then if you hit them, you'll get this AoE. Finishes the spell. 
just barely got that. But other than that, if you're struggling, just take your time. And if you do miss the break bar at 75, 50, and 25%, it's not the end of the world. You'll get another one of those bloodstone protectors. Block the shock achievement, you'll get it here traps. if you broke it's the defiance bar. Sit back and watch you work your oh, look, magic. there's our little Let's eh, make this bye. Quick. The eye is on the move and we need to find it again. Why? What do you care? It's classified. I deserve that. You tell me your plans, and I'll tell you mine. Honestly, I can't. I took a sacred oath, crossed my heart, and hoped to die. And I would die. And if I swear not to tell anyone? Cross my heart. The oath we take is far more intense and binding. Not something you seal with a pinky swear. We'll see what Anise has to say about that. She can't tell you either. But I'm off to HQ to gather intel on the eye's movements. You may as well come along. Where is it? Oh, right. So that I was it. That was everything. I hope the achievements I did cover me in the was helpful mausoleum. and that the ones that I didn't go in full detail, it was enough for you to at least get them. So thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed and I don't know, maybe see you around.